First, connect to the router. Plug in the power cable. Connect your router via the Ethernet, cable, LAN or Wi-Fi. If you choose to connect your LAN cable, connect your router's LAN port and your computer's Ethernet port with an Ethernet cable. If you choose to connect via Wi-Fi, connect to the Wi-Fi code GL-MV1000-XXX. If this is the first time setting up your router, the default Wi-Fi password will be GoodLife, which is also printed on the bottom of the router. If you previously set up and changed the password, please fill in the password that you created. You can also connect to the internet with your WAN port from your modem. Open a web browser, we recommend Chrome or Firefox, and visit our admin panel. Enter the password that you set up with your router. If you are connected via your LAN port, your admin panel should look like this. If you connected via Wi-Fi, the WLAN indicator will be turned on. Second, connect to the internet. After you get to the admin panel, you need to connect to the internet. There are four types of connection methods, cable, tethering, 3G, 4G, USB modem, and repeater. Here, we use the repeater method as an example. In the repeater section, click scan to search for the available wireless network nearby. Then choose an SSID from the drop-down list and enter its password. You can also enable the remember button to save the current wireless network. Finally, click join. Third, upgrade to the latest firmware. You can upgrade to the firmware by online upgrade or by local upgrade via our admin panel. Here we will show you how to update your firmware via an online upgrade. After you connect to the internet, click the upgrade button on the left. A red dot will appear if there is an available update on online upgrade. Click download and wait for the download process. Click install and wait for the installation. After the installation, log in again with your password. To manually upgrade to the latest version, you can also use the local upgrade method. Visit GLINet download site and select the device that you would like to update. In this case, we selected MV1000. Once you accessed, click release. Select and download the latest firmware. In this example, the latest update will be 3.104. Click upgrade on the left and select local upgrade. Drag the file that you downloaded from the download site before. Click install and wait for the installation. After the installation, log in again with your password. Fourth, where to find AdGuard Home. Click upgrade and check if you now have the latest version. In this case, the latest update is for AdGuard Home. Click applications and then AdGuard Home. Now you can use AdGuard Home freely.